Paul and I were talking before the show about this little computer he recommended, which, of course, <laughs> I immediately went oh. out and bought, the Kangaroo PC. Yeah. Sure. $100 Windows 10 uh, PC. It's just cute as a button. Yep. Cute as a bug in a rug. It's battery-powered, uh, four hours battery life. It's got a fingerprint reader. I think that puts it over the top. You know, I didn't realize it's made by Foxconn. <laughs> this is Kangaroo is a Foxconn company. Yeah. Oh, really? So they could easily do things like, hey, we got a couple of these uh, fingerprint sensors lying around. Why don't you put <laughs> yes. that in there? Right. This came off a Samsung Galaxy S6, but yeah. you know, don't worry about it. Matter. No, it's a, you know what? It's a good fingerprint. It's very accurate. Yeah, it is. Very fast. It's a, it's a press one, too. You don't have to swipe it. Yeah. Just go like that. Yeah. It's very much like on a phone. It probably is, as you say, a phone part. Um, and it does Windows Hello. Pretty darn cool, hundred bucks. Mm -hmm. But my the one reason I bought it uh, was because uh, you said it would work with an iPad. You said, yeah, it would, no, I appreciate you making it personal. <laughs> you said it would. Work. <laughs> no, but it does yeah. work with your iPad. It just doesn't with mine sure. and uh, Gary Koffler. So, word of warning, and we'll figure out why. Maybe I, mean, I have photographic iOS. evidence to prove. No, it I works. believe you. I'm not. <laughs> No, you know. I trust you, and I, you know, and they even talk about this particular error that that we're all getting. Extended display is not found in the connected PC. That's that's the error on the iPad, and yeah. uh, they say, oh, if that happens, then uh, hook up an HDMI cable to the Kangaroo, so you have two displays. Mm -hmm. Go into display setting, and then make sure it's an extended display. But the problem is the display setting doesn't see more than one display, so there's something wrong. Yeah, and you know, so I mean, Foxconn's I, I, not known for its software, so. <laughs> <laughs> right. Surprised, uh, right. Beyond the iPad usage, though, it's still kind of an awesome little computer. Oh, gosh, it's a yeah. much better deal than a compute stick or whatever. And uh, I hooked it up to a 27-inch display and a keyboard and the mouse worked great. I hooked it up to a, yeah. a 4K display and it worked. <laughs> I was kind yeah. of amazed. Yeah, we've it's not bad. So you know, 99 far. bucks. Yeah. Yeah, we've come so far. So It's definitely, that's I haven't written it yet, but my uh, my PC picks for the year, that's one of the pieces. That's my budget PC pick. Ah, yeah, 100 bucks. It's yeah, a, it's, you it's know, really I nice. bought that $69 tablet and thought, wow, this is amazing. But this mm -hmm. is 100 and if you have an iPad, yeah, then you don't need a keyboard or a mouse or right. a display. You've got everything you need. And the idea that I could bring this plus my iPad with me, in fact, an iPad Pro with this, means I'd have mm -hmm. a Windows laptop and an iPad. In I know, it's thing. crazy. It's amazing. It's, yeah, it is. It's nuts, you know. It's probably lappable, Mary Jo. It might be. I was just thinking that. Right. Maybe I could somehow hook a mouse up to it and run it on my leg like I do on a plane. Oh, yeah. I, you know, I, use a mouse on your leg on planes, right? Really? Oh, yeah. The, the old <laughs> I know. It's mouse. totally not okay. I've been, I've had wow. to shut it down several times and been told. Oh, they not say you're to. not allowed to. Oh, because to use it's a mouse? Uh, Bluetooth. Right. No, no Bluetooth. They, told, they used to so, tell me no wired mouse because yeah. it transmits yeah. over the wire. 